now we'll see how to define the variables so this was the model that we have built till now now to define the variables and their functions we'll start with the uh, initial input so if we see that the waste generation waste and waste collection these three variables are interrelated and interconnected but the initial the endpoints from or initial points or beginning of variables that we can see that waste correction factor waste generation factor dl target comparator target and bulldozer target so these are the initial points from the model start so we'll start defining this variable now let's say we are uh, starting with the uh, waste generation factor uh, we are putting the waste generation factor as 10 value and that is a constant value okay now uh, in here on the right hand side you can see that there are uh, all the variables that we have defined till now so we can change the variable from in here only so waste generation has been uh, defined now waste collection so we have defined waste collection as 15 now next one is DL target so DL target let's say we want to DL target and that we have given as 25,000 value now comparator target that is 50,000 and uh, bulldozer target that is 10,000 okay so now the initial points all the initial points have been defined so all five points are given now the next one is WMS collection goal so from these three inputs our WMS collection goal will be defined so move on to collection WMS collection now we have given a function in such fashion that all the three inputs are considered and minus the waste collection variable has, has been um, subtracted from the total value okay, so whatever the uh, total waste is collected that is uh, subtracted from the target values and we have also given the units <coughs> to this variable as kg now if you see that all the three variable input are defined WMS collection goal is defined it will go to waste so now we can define the waste but you will see that waste generation is given in uh, waste so that will be somewhat a waste generation okay now we have generated a waste of 200 you can give the value of uh, waste generation as kg the uh, waste generation is uh, produced in ki uh, kilogram now waste collection now move on to waste collection so that is also uh, so waste collection is 150 now only one variable is remaining that is wms collection sorry waste so for that also we have calculated in uh, we have given the definition or a function for waste variable is in uh, this manner so waste collection sorry waste generation into waste generation factor and waste collection and waste collection factor these are multiplied now waste generation and waste uh, collection goal these are ad added and from that waste collection is uh, subtracted so this is how the waste function will look like we now we'll check the syntax the equation is okay so we can move on now if we, uh, for any of the variable if you need the need uh, to explain the variable that you can explain it or leave the comments in here the comment bo box okay now <coughs> presentation we will save the model as our base we okay. will save the model as base each and every time if you are uh, let's say you are doing some trials on multiple models or different values of these same models then you can define each set of functions or each set, set of variables as a uh, you can say simulation set so we can give the names 
to this simulations so first one we are starting with base and uh, let's see we are starting this one okay. uh, one more thing we can add one graph in here from this input output tool <coughs> object tool so once you click on this input output ob object tool this uh, window will pop up now from this one you can select the workbench tool and from that select on graph now let's say we are <coughs> generating a graph for okay uh, because the uh, already first trial has been defined in here let's say we have uh, as we have defined the base simulation you can start <coughs> you can define a different simulation and give it a different name we will define another trial that is trial 2 and you can understand it better when we have both the simulations in this now so this is how the, your model will look like now once the model is defined and generated you can run the simulation now Now, uh, there was a problem with this one variable that is west collection. So, uh, the problem was that uh, the west collection is coming out from the west. So, we need to define it in terms of west. We cannot give it a, as a constant value. So, we have given, uh, we have corrected it in here. So, from the all whatever the west is there, from that, 80% of the west is collected into west collection. Uh, okay so that is corrected and uh, another problem with uh, that is with waste generation okay. again waste generation is also giving input to the waste variable and taking input from this waste uh, waste variable so it is a you can say inter uh, interrelated or inter inter x uh, looped type of variable Okay, loop type of variable so that is why we need to again let's say 60% of whatever the best value is there so that is uh, given to the best generation again okay. now all the variables are defined there is no error so we can run the simulation to run the simulation there are two options that is simulate and synthesis simulation so when you simulate that will give you just a single simulation for that you will be having multiple uh, all the values let's say for here we had taken 50 values so this 50 values you can see in this graph okay now uh, all these 50 values you can see in this graph table format also from this table you will see that uh, for base base generation model the values are given in here and uh, also for any of the variable you can plot a chart with this tool first select the variable for which you want to plot a graph then click on this graph and it will show you the values so this is how the best uh, WMS collection goal will look like okay. now move on to uh, second simulation type okay so first simulate you can just run a one uh, one iteration of the simulation and uh, if you select on this synthesis sim then you will see that 